Well, hello everyone. So today I'm making a video, kind of sort of like more on the less of a tutorial video on like styling and shit like that, just because I felt like why not. Um, I'm going to show you guys how to, you know, achieve a uh, sort of slick back hairstyle or pompadour. Um, as you guys have probably seen in some of my videos, you know, how the way I wear my hair and shit like that. Uh, yeah, so currently I am trying to grow out my sides because I want to get them all like slick back, but of course that's taking a little bit. But uh, I, I guess I'll show you guys what I've been doing to my hair as of recent because I've been doing it a little bit differently. Um, and this way it's a lot faster. So what you want to do is you want to go ahead and just make your hair just a little bit damp. It doesn't have to be soaking wet, just get it a little bit damp. Uh, this way it's just, it makes it easier to distribute the product through your hair. Now usually I don't do this. I usually don't wet my hair. I actually put a heat protectant in and I blow dry it and then afterwards I ended up straightening it and then I put in some, uh, some of this stuff right here. It's Hans Fuko sponge wax. I don't know if you can see that. I've been using that, but I discovered some of their other products and I've been using some of the Modify Pomade. And the Modify Pomade, it's actually like more or less of a, uh, well, it's pomade, you know, it's been used for so long, you know, years and years and years. But anyway, so you want to start out with your hair, like, damp, and go ahead and unscrew the cap. Then get yourself, I don't know, maybe about that much. And then... You just want to work it through your hands, and you'll notice that it starts to show up white. Uh, as like a sort of white kind of sort of uh, texture to it once you actually rub it between your hands. Now start off with a little bit, you know, everyone's hair is different. For me, this should be enough, but uh, if I feel like it's still a little bit loose, then I'll just add just a tiny bit more. But usually you don't really have that problem, so... Just want to rub it all through your hair like so, root to tip. Then kind of start to mold it with your hands. It smells really good, by the way, too. Um, the other, I never really was a fan of pomades. The only other pomade that I used besides this one was the American Crew pomade, and that one sucks. I gave it to my friend. He likes it more, so good for him. But. To me, it just didn't really hold up my hair very well, and it was very, very clumpy. So, then you want to take your comb. I use a uh, rat tail comb. And what you want to do is you want to start from the, uh, you know, where the bangs area is at. And just kind of sort of mold it down. You can go for just a classic slick back. You can go for a pompadour. It doesn't really matter. For me, how I've been doing it is basically just kind of like this. Um... Nothing too, too fancy. It's super simple and easy. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. And just add some finishing touches to it. And that's pretty much all I do. Um, I can't wait for the sides of my hair to grow out so I can slick it all back. Uh, but once that, you know, once it's actually grown out to a pretty decent length, then maybe I'll make a new video showing that off, but this is what I've been doing to my hair so recently. It takes me no more than like a minute to achieve this, and right now it's just a four minute video of me explaining stuff. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, definitely go and check out the Hansa Fuko brand. Uh, this is their Modify Pomade. I recommend the sponge wax as well because it gives a matte finish. This leaves you more of a uh, shiny finish because it's a pomade. They all have a dry shampoo in them, and for every purchase that you make, they send you a free sample. So, for instance, uh, like my recent purchase that I made, because I bought another thing of sponge wax as well as the Modify Pomade, they also sent me a little bit of their hybridized wax. And this stuff smells absolutely amazing. It smells so good. I haven't tried it yet, but... That's how I found out about the Modify Pomade, because when I purchased the Spongebox before, they sent me a free sample of the Modify Pomade. 
So I was like, all right, well, I'll just buy a whole new, like, big jar and just try it out. And I have to say, I really like it a lot. So, yeah. Uh, that's really all I have to say. So I hope you enjoyed this video. And, yeah, try and uh, do it with your hair. See you guys later.